Cheeto over here that's like calling my name so I got 
on your clothes as well as like embedded bacteria, whatever. I mean, it's probably just a selling point with COVID going on, but no joke. My clothes smell so good with it. And right now I'm rubbing my pants that were washed in that detergent. And just the smell is like radiating, radiating, radiating off of it. It's like waft. It smells so good. Oh, isn't that the best? Isn't that the best? Isn't that, oh my god, it's just the best when you get into bed. When you have clean, fresh sheets. Oh, girl, that's bomb. That's just, you sleep so good. Especially if you've had like some kind of bath or something before. Some sleepy time tea. Maybe a little bowl. Shit, maybe even some of a brownie. I don't know what you guys do. But I know that having fresh sheets and just making sure, obviously, your body is really, really relaxed and, of course, clean. You won't sleep any, any better. Any better. Any better. Well, you, and, of course, listening to ASMR along with it. called GTFO and it is called Girl 
culture and if you don't know James Charles he is a YouTuber a makeup influencer guy he was on Cover Girl and you know Ellen DeGeneres show all these things for being like one of the pioneers of young men in the makeup industry and then Manny, went, Manny MUA followed and so on and so forth but, um, but um, that is just in regards to the YouTube world because like there was always other men in the makeup industry of course but but but, but it was more widely accepted when James kind of came out with all of his makeup skills makeup skills he inspired a lot of young men online now with that he gets a lot of fans right and these young boys look up to him look up to him look up to him as an influencer so because he has this power he was talking to young men and kind of convincing them to come see him and what have you even though they were young and underage 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 which is no bueno so I don't know I don't know I don't know how I feel about all that he, he's the adult he should have looked up and asked these kids for their identification that kind of thing if he wasn't sure and he's even said that he likes the look of young men and I don't know it just kind of creeps me out creeps me out creeps me out I want to have some more Zona but it's making me bloated Of course, of course, of course. You may bring her. 
she um she is African American, black, whatever, and she had the cutest little oh my god, the cutest hair. She had these cute little um it was, you know, parted like in, in four separate little braids. Braids braids and she had the cutest little bows in her braids and they were all twisted, all cute. Oh my god, she looked so cute. And I said, sweetie, 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 we have to take, we have to take an x-ray on your mommy, so I can't have you in the room. So Kylie is gonna go ahead and take your mom to do the x-ray, but you can hang out with me at the front desk, okay? You can help me out. So she's sitting with me, and I'm working, and I actually brought, I brought, I brought, I brought the donuts to work, and there were some extra, 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 so of course I wanted to share with her. So she had her headphones on, and she was watching like a little YouTube video or something, and I tapped her, and I said, hey, hey. Someone at the front, <laughs> and I go, Thank you, sweetheart. 